Hi, how's it going folks? Sam Scott Dragon and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Ev Ascended. <laughs> I keep wanting to say evolved. Um, my island to Scotch playthrough. Yeah, so we're having really, really a lot of fun in this dinner. Uh, it's been really, really good. Um, but yeah, we got our breeding area built. Which is quite big, I think we could actually breed gigas in here. I'm looking at the height, I think we could breed gigas in here quite comfortably, which is fantastic as well. So, what are we getting up to this time? I'm going to get my camera sorted. I, I get the silver a wee dot of paint again. It just takes that silver in a shove, but it's actually quite effective. Quite like that. Uh, I can't get the other colours to make <laughs> And we go to a wee egg hatchery down and Usually it's a dodo, so it's quite nice that it's a wee rex I don't know if it works, mind you Then we need to try it And this is the nanny here I don't know what's wrong with it um, It's supposed to be like that I don't know what it's supposed to look like But we have a nanny <laughs> So I am yeah, I'm looking forward to breeding. Hopefully that's going to be able to do the imprint. Um, we've got a couple of fridges, that's all we needed, and a few. These are a show that they've got a larger area. So we're going to build something here. We're going to go back to the tree saps. Trap sap, tree saps. Can't even speak. Right, Mr. Parasaur, you are we're going to survive this. Um, yeah. So, the more I sat and thought about it, the more it made sense actually. I, I haven't built on the platform so you will. So it'll be nice. Um, it's not going to be anything too extravagant, too fancy or anything. But I can't remember if they've done it now so you can build straight onto the platform. Or if you've still got to put foundations down. I am not 100% sure that shows you how long ago it was since I built on a tree platform. Usually I just throw down a teleporter or in a box sometimes, or a bed, and that's it. If I have to get teleporters, I put down a bed, a box, and the tree saps. Then it just means I spawn over there. Empty the tree sap uh, taps before the Archie uh, Archaeopteryx gets them and puts the sap into the box and then spawn back. So I go over naked so it's there's nothing getting lost in between. Um yeah. Yeah, I don't like this up here. So we're putting that over there. We're gonna build something over there for that, so Look too high. Yeah, I think so. And the only problem is, well, we'll do it with the chunkier ones this time because it actually it is going to be quite a sturdy structure. So we'll try that. And um, we'll go five. And the good thing is, the knees fit on. The knees fit on to the ceilings, and they fit together. I'm hoping this is going to work. Um, oh, it is as well. Are you kidding me? That's genius. Right. And then, if it comes to it, I bet you. Yeah. I'm going to try. And we're not going to be able to do this whole structure with just that one pillar there, are we? Surely not. It's... No, there we go. So we need support. Right, well that's fine. Because then, with that, to keep it, like, cut sort of in a patterned, patterned shape 
hoping then right, we could go at that corner that might be, that might be worthwhile if we go at the corner there because then that will take us in a bit I'll all sort these pillars out properly um, once I get the initial shape up. It's going to take a wee bit of time to get this initial shape. I've never built this before either, so this might take me a wee while, folks. Um, one, two, three. We are going to do the hexagonal, hexagonal shape, but as I said, we are going to be doing a platform. So we've got to make sure that everything is right and everything's supported. Yeah, because it's going to be huge. I didn't realise it was going to be that big. But it's a 3x3, three three, so it's the same size as the breeding area. Right, that'll be fine, but no foundation support, so we need to just, if we follow uh, what we've been doing before, just catching it in at this corner here, which should lock in. There we are. Perfect. That's our outer ring sorted. So that should give us quite a bit of. Coverage and leeway to ah, uh, give me up. Um, follow on, come on. this now I'm up top I'm going to put the stairs up as well but this should now have the coverage that I need for to get a bit of this done Yeah, I think there must be a wee dip in the ground there somewhere. And it was enough just to let the heart of the wing get a little spar through it, so which is not Can you get that or no? Nah, see it's not letting me it's not gonna snap on to any more snap points because it's too far in. Right, so I'm gonna just put that away just now and I'm gonna see if we can fill in the centerpiece. Six. No, we can't. Oh, that's interesting. Right. So these don't give foundation support. I thought they did. On the outside they do. But not on the inside. Oh, that's interesting. See, the good thing about that is, it means I've figured something out. Don't know what I've figured out, but I've <laughs> figured something out. <laughs> Let's see this now. Place. And we're going to just change to a wee thin one. Right. And I want to see if this is going to... The round on here are gonna get eaten. I've got hungry animals. There we go. Now we've got foundation support and we've disguised the foundations in with the wood, which is gonna be good. So it means I can finish this off like so. Like that right so we can go over these and cross them as well 
The big thing is, I quite actually like the looks of that. See where the wee thin pillars coming through that. I really like the looks of that. So, here we go. We're going to try something. Okay. Okay. It's not collapsed yet. I'll emphasize yet. Because <laughs> no matter what we will. Right, we'll just go over to the next point. I do like the look of that with the, the, the pillar through the wood. That is really cool looking. I think we could get away with this. If we're careful. Yeah. I think we hit the jackpot there. We got very, very lucky. I don't know how, but I we got very lucky there. We managed to do that. So that looks nice and tidy under there now. That is fantastic. I'm really, really happy with that. Yes, yeah, so I need to make a lot more of these. I've got one here, one there. Now we need to, which becomes the pain part. We've got your hat R. And can we get, yes, we can get some of these. I think we'll get some of them as well. So we did actually have metal, I don't know why it wasn't pulling. I don't know, sometimes the, the pulling system just doesn't work properly. Um, but yeah, we did have enough metal to get this finished. So we've done our... Uh, we extended these stairs as well from one to three. Because if I'm teleporting back in with a dino, I want to be able to walk down with a dino. Without having to get off and then cry what up and then throw, carry all the stuff down. So at least that way I can walk down with a dino and then unload it into the base. Right, so we made, gave ourselves a wee fancy design. I will go around and I'll paint paint the rest of the roof. It's just me personal teleporter that's up here than out that will do for the time being. I may change it to one of the big ones or I may just leave it as one of the wee ones. So it's taken me, taken me a wee while to get what we've got but what we've got is fantastic. Um, it's gained us some build platform um, so we'll carry on with that tomorrow but I'm going to call it quits for today. Um, we made absolutely fantastic looking I really like, I really like this my teleporter platform my new home for my RJ and my Pteranodon instead of being up on the roof they're going to live up here and guard this with their lives so <laughs> um, yeah so if you've enjoyed the video don't forget to hit the thumbs up button does the channel wonders also if you're not yet subscribed we subscription is most welcome and totally appreciated also hit the notification bell so you don't miss any episodes, any upcoming footage, shenanigans, community posts, and I will fill you in, we had one crash. We've had one wee crash when we were teleporting just there. Uh, it took us back a bit. I did record a wee bit after it. Um, but that is the first crash we've had since starting this series, which that is fantastic. I can handle that easily enough. I think a lot of people could after the way the game has been running. So, yeah. We'll give you that wild card at the moment. Just don't let us down with others. <laughs> um, yeah, so hit us up in the comments in the comment section down below. I do reply to all my comments. It would be great to hear from you. Um, yeah, it'd be good if you are playing yourselves. Um, be good to hear how you are finding that and how you are getting on with it. So take care, stay safe. We'll catch you in the next one.